Good morning everyone. So we have some new stuff to review today, which I'm really excited about. We have these spoiler animations for the Tennessee Walking Horses, and then we have the Magic Winter Horses and Pets, and I'm excited for both of these. Just a quick disclaimer before I get started, if you guys want to win a free gift from Horse Tales with the game, with merchandise and goodies from them, then make sure to check out my last video where I actually make a giveaway. They sent me a physical package with actual cool stuff to send back to you, so if you want to enter that giveaway, I'll link it in the description, comment section, and in the top right corner. All right. Let's get started with the Tennessee Walking Horses animation. So I did look up the gates of this horse from real life. I did that because I didn't want to be criticizing Star Stable for something they've done right, but just because I'm uncultured, I wouldn't know. Do you know what I mean? So this is the Tennessee Walking Horse. No way, dude. I thought this was a freaking rodent. The first thing that I'm noticing is how stiff the um, neck and the head is. I'm pretty sure this is a stepping pace because the back foot hits the ground before the front foot does. So, I think this is the stepping pace, I might be wrong, so take everything I say with a grain of salt. Alright, I think this is a trot, I don't think this is a flat walk or anything, this looks like a trot to me. And it looks good, and I also like the, um, the step pace, or the walking, whatever, the first animation, the gate, it's this one, the first one, I like it, it's perfect. There's absolutely nothing to complain about it, literally nothing. I feel like Star Stable really nailed it. And the horse is beautiful, bro. The face of it is stunning. I didn't think I would like these horses, but I really do. They're amazing. Even though, like, I would never own a Tennessee walking horse in real life, just because gated horses are just not my thing. Um, okay, this is a canter. And honestly, you know, gated horses do bounce their heads in canter, but this is a bit too much. It looks just... I don't know how to say it. The horse's head just looks very stiff. All right, this is the, I think, slow gallop. I don't think this is the running walk. I don't think Star Stable's added a running walk animation for these horses. This does not look like a running walk. This is literally just like gallop, like a running, you know what I mean? Um, and I really do like it. Like there's nothing to complain about it. This coat is also really cool. Yeah, I like it. No, the animations are good. I think the canter is like something I like a bit reserved about. All right, this is the reverse. I like it. It's, it's cool. The special gate. Is this the... Is this the fast walk? The running walk? Or is this the rack? Alright, I'm pretty sure this is the running walk and I'm so happy that Star Stable didn't animate this horse in a way that's just extreme. Um, I'm so happy that, you know, it's more of a casual Tennessee walking horse. I'm also really happy they didn't add the abusive big lick animations and gates into the game. People are just sick, bro. I literally just watched the video of the big lick. People are sick. How disgusting and cruel can one be? Do you know what I mean? Anyway, um, all right, let's go to jumps. I literally ruined my mood. I literally just ruined my mood. I watched videos of the big lick and now I'm really angry. Like I literally just ruined my mood. Anyway, okay, these are the jumps. Um, I've never seen a Tennessee Walking Horse jump actually, so let me let me look at one first. I can't just complain if I don't know what the jump is like in real life. Alright gamers, so I just looked up some references for the jumping horse, I mean the jumping animation, I mean the jumping gate of a Tennessee Walking Horse in real life, and it's really accurate. Um, even like the way it holds the back legs in the jump, they're not very stretched out, they're pretty bent, that's what they do in real life too, and um, just the way they go so upward, like almost like a rocket, like when jumping, they first push really, really hard with the back legs, you know what I mean, and they form this like, just straight back, that makes sense? Just very accurate to to the real life jumping. You know what? Star Stable's done a really good job. Like I think these are one of the most accurate horses that we have so far in the game, and they're not even ready. They're not even done yet. Like these are the this is in you know the work in progress stage still. But I'm really impressed, bro. And I'm not the one to like these horses in real life either. Like I'm not a huge fan of the of the breed, but Star Stable's really nailed it. Like I'm I'm really happy and impressed. All right, this is a stop. <laughs> it looked like it took a dump there. <laughs> Wait, let me see that again. I like it. It reminds me a bit of the of the quarter horse. Just a little bit. Alright, the rear. Whoa. I don't hate it. 
I don't I don't dislike it, but I'm also like I need some time to process all this because it's so different than what we have in the game as of right now. Well, because the horse breed is so different. You know what? I kind of like it. Like it's interesting. All right, the dance, bro. Literally, no one cares about the dance. But I actually like this one stance. Like the way it just stops and opens, opens its eyes like that. It's pretty cool. Okay, the idle animations. I really like them. Bro, I really like this horse, like, a lot. I like this horse a lot. What is wrong with me? I, I never thought I would, like... I didn't think I would buy this horse. Like, when I first found out that Star City was bringing out a Tennessee walking horses, I was like, okay, that's cool, but it's not for me. You know what I mean? I wasn't excited, necessarily. The animations are just perfect. Like, there's nothing... I love it. It's perfect. I love it so much. It's beautiful. And the face of the horse, it's so mild and, like, so tame. I don't know how to explain it. The horse looks so pure and innocent. I love it. Like the eyes of it, bro. Such innocent pure eyes. Okay, and then let's see the horse in the race. <laughs> the big tongue, bro. Alright, let's see the, the horse in the race. It reminds me of the Akaltekis. Just because they have such slim bodies and the butt is so slim. Yeah, I don't know. I think Star Stable's done a really good job to represent this horse breed in the game. They really have. And again, I'm so happy they didn't exaggerate the gates. I'm so happy they didn't um, add any like abusive gates, like the big lick gate, like extreme rack gates, you know what I mean? Happy they didn't do that. Alright, cool. Colors and main styles, let's see. I wonder if they have any like special main styles for this horse breed. I'm really in love with these horses, bro. I really am. Oh, this is the roan coat. Yeah, the roan coat is cool. Look at its face, bro. You just want to freaking squeeze that face, you know what I mean? Um, okay, this is, oh, the main styles. I don't like this one. This one is, oh, the braids. I will not be getting braids. Can you guys believe that? I don't think I'll be getting braids. Then the shaved main style. Oh, these are looking bad, bro. Like, on, I don't know I don't know a single horse on which those braids look good. This one is all right. Okay, this one is the next coat, which looks really sick. I like it a lot. The dappling is amazing. The shading is really cool. The hoof details, stunning. Star Stable is like nailing it, bro. Like, I'm just so happy the way Star Stable has just been making horses lately. And I know we have, we're getting way too many horses, but bro, like, this is a horse reviewing video. I will say what I have to say about the horses. They look good. The main styles, I think the, the original one is the best. And then maybe this one, the razor cut. Wow. This coat is, looks like a fish, like a solid fish, but I like it. Wow, bro. The amount of detail. Oh my goodness, bro. This is such a beautiful horse. It's got a heart on the muzzle, can you guys see that? <laughs> the black heart. The amount of detail on this horse is absolutely insane. Oh wow, with the braids. I might be getting the braids for this one, or the shave mane. Because there's so much... Can you shut your mouth up? So as I was saying before I got really interrupted by this freaking car outside. Yeah, the amount of detail this horse has. I, I This is my favorite new horse, I'm telling you. And even this one, wow. Bro, this horse is stunning. When I saw the first spoilers, I wasn't as excited for it, but it's beautiful. It reminds me so much of a horse from Red Redemption. Wow. Star Stable, you're just... You just know what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? You just know what you're doing. Okay, the braids are really good in this one, too. And the shaved mane, too. I don't like these ones, bro. These braids, they better be removed. <laughs> I'm joking. I wonder if there's anyone that likes those. Okay, then there's this one. Um, hmm. I actually don't dislike this horse coat, and I thought I would. I actually think it's pretty, like, it's very realistic. Hence why I really am considering getting it, maybe. I think it's a Carmelo. It's not a Perlino, is it? Imagine, imagine being a Perlino. <laughs> oh, I like the braids on the tail. Do the normal braids come with that, too? Oh, yeah. The braided tail looks really good. This horse is nice. I surprisingly like it. I don't know who I am anymore. Like, I don't know why I like this horse, but I kind of do. Maybe I'm not going to be getting it, but I have nothing to complain. Oh, it looks like the Appaloosa horse. It reminded me so much of the fish magic Appaloosa horse. I don't know why the face of it here. That's worrisome. The next one is the black one from Fort Pinta. Um, I like it. Yeah, it's beautiful. You know what's really odd, though? We haven't gotten any, like, just plain chestnut Tennessee walking horses, which is black plain solid black Tennessee walking horses and when you think of a Tennessee walking horse you usually think of either a chestnut Tennessee walking horse or a plain solid black Tennessee walking horse we haven't gotten any of those we've got an oldies freaking amazing 
complex and detailed codes, which is cool, but it's just weird that we didn't get the basic ones. Do you know what I mean? Oh my goodness, the app horse. Okay, also available to buy in game. I'm gonna buy it in the app because I hate training. I mean, I don't hate it, but it's, you know, I'd rather have a horse be level 10 than level one. Okay, this horse is really sick. I'm telling you this horse is stunning, beautiful. There's a lot of horses I wanna buy. You know what really bothers me though? The fact that the mane and the tail are so white and they feel almost fake. With the braids though, the braids have the same color as the horse does. It's more of a gray, it's more of a gray tone white rather than just solid white color. So it looks more realistic, you know, when they go in the braids mode or shaved mane. Even here in the shaved mane and even here, they look way more like real. But when the horse has a long mane, the mane is too white. It almost feels fake. Might be only my brain, dude. Might be only my in my head. But anyway, see how like this color is just so much more better than the white one for the mane. This is so much better, so much realistic to me at least. And it's weird because even the tail color changes to a gray. And that's a bit weird. Is that a bug? I don't know. Might get fixed or might not. Size comparison. Oh, they're pretty. They're smaller, they're shorter than these starter horses. Who would have thought it? Maybe everyone but me because I'm uncultured. But anyway. <laughs> okay, they're sold at Starshine Ranch. Bro, this one right here is beautiful. All of them are beautiful, actually. Oh, and also in the Winter Village. So we're gonna be getting them probably next month, I assume. Alright, they're gonna be a 950. That is quite some money there, but I get it. They're the Tennessee Walking Horses. Okay, so we're also gonna be reacting to the Magic Winter Horses and Pets video again by CC Creations. I forgot to mention that, but you guys already know. I'm kind of excited for the Winter Village. Oh, this is new. I've always loved the Winter Village. I don't know why. Star Stable is just always nailed it with the Winter Village. This is a new Icelandic horse, isn't it? What are you showing us, you little rodent? Okay, this is a white Pasifino. Yes, I did just call it a white horse. Shut your little stinky rat mouth up. With like speckles. And then, yeah, I think this is the, is that a new pet? A new tack? I think so. It's funny how I'm just so unaware. Oh, that is nice. And that owl is nice. I'm gonna be getting that one. So, I don't think I'm gonna be getting what? Why did it change coats? I don't know, maybe because it's a magic horse? Okay, actually it's beautiful. Like, it's actually stunning, but... I don't know why I don't like the Pasavino horse. Whoa, whoa. Holy smokes, bro. The bunny is, a, is beautiful. Oh, that's cool. And also the Icelandic's coat. Wow. That is, that's cool. I like that. The hooves. Oh wow, the eye is beautiful. Okay, I might be, I might have to buy this one too, even though I don't like the Pasifinos as much anymore. Bro, this Icelandic horse is stunning. I need to get this one too. I'm gonna spend so many star coins, but it's just too beautiful not to have. Do you know what I mean? Oh, I love the sliding thing on the eyes. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get all of them. Wow. It looks like it's got like snow on it, you know what I mean? Like after a snowball fight. Bro, I'm actually like really impressed and happy. Like I'm excited for these updates. For the winter village update and then for the new tenancy walking horses they're really dope all right if you're gonna see more videos from me then please subscribe ring the bell like this video and please comment down below what you think of the new tenancy walking horses and of the winter village the magic winter horses and pets because i i want to know and do not forget to enter the giveaway little rodent my comment section has been and always will be a place where you'll be able to express your opinions about the game in a very free manner all right guys i'll see you in my next one have a good one